Hey, what's up, guys? Nick Fix here, a teenager with autism, and I've lost 10 pounds. Like, I was on the scale the other day, and I lost 10 pounds. Like, seriously, 10, 1, 0. I was so happy. It was like 15, actually, because I started weight loss journey at 205. It's currently raining behind me, walking home from the bus. So I have a story I'm going to tell you all about the bus today, how I overcame the challenge. But let's talk about the weight. So, I originally weighed two, like 205, 206. I dropped to about two to three weeks going to the gym. I dropped to two, oh, or two. Take the two away. I dropped to 180 to 185. Now it's probably also because I'm back in school and I have to walk home and everything. And right now where I am in Southwest New York State, not the city, it's raining. <laughs> Which where I live, the corn needs it. Like, the farmers, the corn needs it. Got the boots on. But the corn needs it. The hat today is the axe and sled ball cap. But, like I was saying, the corn seriously needs it. Anyways, topic of the bus. So, I transferred buses and everything went fine. I get on my bus, we're just heading down the road. First, the unnamed bus driver misses somebody's stop. That's first. You know? Everybody's chilling still at this point. Like, he turns around and just uh, backs up. We get it going. Second, we're driving. We're getting close to where I'm, like, my house area. And he slams on the brakes. No, this is something he may not or may normally do. I don't know. But he slams on the brake and almost everybody goes forward and hits their seat. I was smart enough. Being an emergency responder as a volunteer fireman, I had my arm out because I saw that there was cars in front of him. And I knew that he might have to make a sudden break. So I had my arm out and I protected myself. But that waked me up, dude. I was about half asleep. Because I sometimes will fall asleep in the car. But I was like half asleep. But that's a challenge. And how you can overcome that is if you know somebody's going to slam on the brakes, put your arm out on something by you. And just you lean onto your arm and your arm will stop you and you can push yourself back up very easily. And... The next topic of this video is listen to the smell of the rain. So beautiful. I love the smell of the rain. Helps corn grow. You ever eat corn cab? But the smell of the rain helps corn grow and stuff. But let's <clears throat> get into the positive topic. <laughs> Taking a little while. Taking a little bit of a while, but let's get this turn. And it's something that I personally would like to address. And that is positivity. Stay positive, love life, everything like that. Like these colors on the stairs, love it. Flat out love. Yeah, I'm gonna sit down for a minute and record this video. But flat out love it. You know, and everything like with the weather and stuff lately where I've lived, I've just been great. A little bit of a funny story. Like I was saying, a little bit of a funny story, a little off topic. But the other day, like they, I had to get physical therapy for my back. You know, being overweight, being overweight can bring you some posture problems. But the other day, I had gotten physical therapy scheduled for six o'clock in the morning. Now, I'm not a morning person by no means. So I wake up, I'm not planning on going. And this day I got canceled because I woke up past six. But we can't do six in the morning for me because in physical therapy, they bark orders at you and I'm not good with that in the morning. But. So. Gonna be painting the deck this weekend. Possibly a Deck color of a cab back, deck correct. That should be fun. 
It's definitely going to be a shorter video, a little off topic, but I just figured I'd stop in and record. So, subscribe. It's free on most platforms like YouTube. Hit the notification button so you're always notified. Give me a like if you like the video and stay positive and peace.